Right, welcome back. You're watching Maisha TV. My name is Bushabe Jr. This is Maisha Prime News. Now let's shift focus to education segment. At a time when knowledge is required for thriving in a fast-growing society, the government has put measures to ensure that every child is entitled to education. This is no difference to Maliki Boys High School, a school headed by senior principal Mr. Justice Abuko, who now spearheads an academic evolution in Tongaren sub-county in Bungoma County. My name is Justice Abuko. A senior principal Maliki Boys High School. Uh, I came to this school in January uh, 2022 uh, from Bushangala Secondary School. Uh, Maliki Boys High School is in Ngoma North Sub County, Ngoma County. It is found on Webuye Kitale Road. Uh, it is 30 kilometers from Webuye. Uh, it is the center of excellence in Ngoma North. Uh, when I reported to Maliki Boys, uh, the school is doing well. Uh, in terms of teachers, I found 42 teachers. Right now we have 49 teachers. Uh, 41 of them uh, t uh, employed by the Teacher Service Commission. Uh, in terms of enrollment, I found 751 students. Uh, this year we were very lucky. Uh, we, rep we got 361 uh, form ones, uh, and that increased the number of streams, form one streams, uh, to six. Uh, we are hoping that in future we are going to have more students coming to this school. Achievement, academic achievement and also in co-curricular. Uh, in academics, in 2020, uh, we had a mean of 5.01. Uh, unfortunately, in 2021, the mean came down a bit to 4.4. Uh, we are hoping that this year uh, we are going to get a much higher mean than the 5.01 that we recorded sometimes in 2020. 2020. Uh, the number of non-teaching staff is 21. Uh, most of them are PNP, permanent, permanently employed. Uh, the school also has a good infrastructure uh, we have four very big dormitories that is able to house over a thousand boys. Uh, we have 21 classrooms currently. We have a big dining hall together with the kitchen. Uh, we have three, two laboratories, twin laboratory. Uh, we are currently putting up a physics laboratory. And uh, we also have a big library uh, that is was donated uh, to the school by the Lubaga uh, family. Uh, this library has enabled us, has enabled the school to raise its standards of academics uh, because the students are able to access that laboratory. Sorry, library. Uh, the library has enough books and uh, it's also the area, the room is very conducive uh, for reading. Apart from the academic leverage, the school has invested in other economic-based programs such as maize farming and vegetable farming. I found a bakery that was not doing so well. We are in the process of uh, reorganizing our bakery uh, so that it can be an income generating activity. Uh, we also have uh, Sukuma Wiki. We have a large farm. I've started planting Sukuma Wiki so that we can be self-sufficient uh, in terms of Sukuma Wiki. Uh, we also have dairy animals. Uh, unfortunately, they are free range. We are hoping that in future uh, we'll be able to 
confine zero grass them so that uh, we can get more milk than uh, what we are getting right now but uh, even now i think uh, the animals are able to give us milk the students also engage in sports and other useful co-curricular activities the school for a long time is known for its superiority in ball games athletics music among other sporting activities in terms of co-curricular activities we are powerhouse uh, malik is known for football malik is known for handball malik is known for rugby uh, currently in the ongoing games uh, the three teams football rugby and uh, and uh, football rugby and handball are qualified for the county games uh, we are hoping that they are going to perform well and make it to the regional uh, which will be held in kakamega st peter's mumias With the help of the passionate teaching staff, the school is striving to give an excellent academic performance in the coming KCSE exams. Uh, the current form for class, we have 158 candidates. Uh, we are about to complete the syllabus. As you know, that uh, the academic year has been interrupted severely. Uh, but we are hoping that by next week, that is... Uh, uh, September 5th will be through with the syllabus uh, so that we can embark on serious revision with our current candidate class. Uh, we are looking forward to very good academic grades from them uh, so that they can live to the name of the school. Hi. For Maisha Prime, Maisha Television, Education Segment, Ambusha B. Junior.